I'm Sarah Bradley and I'm the author of True, uh, a book written for 11 to 14 year old girls about living as a Christian. I wrote this book because I love Jesus and I love following him, but I think sometimes it can be hard and I think teenage girls have a lots of different things to navigate through in life and I wanted this book to really help them to navigate through some of the big issues that they're looking at and help them to think about what the Bible says and what it looks like to live as a Christian as we're thinking about friends, about boys, about parents and about various different things in life. I wrote a book for 11 to 14 year olds because I've been working with youth and children for a long time and it's a great age, I love working with them, they're a lot of fun, but it is a, an age where things are difficult. Uh, they're starting secondary school, they're kind of being bombarded by the media, by friends, peer pressure, different things and all the, uh, with lots of different problems and difficulties and I wanted a book that would really speak into that and help them. And there aren't many books that are written for that age group and I really felt that this was a book, uh, probably the book I would like to have read when I was that age. It's answered some of the questions that I was grappling with and I thought this would be a real helpful book for girls of that age. Uh, the book is written largely for Christians. Uh, there are a number of teenagers, 11 to 14, who know that they're following Jesus and this book will really help them to put that into practice and to live it out wholeheartedly, living for Jesus every day. But it's also for those who are perhaps still thinking things through or those that don't have a faith but are, are wanting to know what the world is all about, what the Bible has to say and how they can live this life uh, understanding what Jesus has to say into it. I think the book can be used in a number of ways. It can be given to an 11 to 14 year old girl to read on her own. Uh, there are chapters to read and there are studies to do at the end. She could do it by herself. But it could also be done, a mother and a daughter would be a great way of doing it. It's also been used in youth groups where youth leaders have done it with a group of girls. Uh, girls could do it together with their friends. It can be used in a variety of ways, but its idea is that it's a book that is not just to be read and put on a shelf, but you can go back to it again and again to re-look at studies, reread the chapters where you're really questioning things again or struggling with different things. So it's a, a go-to book again and again rather than a, I've read it and I'm done now. My prayer for the book is that as girls read it, they would be excited by who Jesus is and what he's done for them, that they would be excited by reading the Bible and wanting to, to read it more as they see that the Bible speaks into their lives, even at 11, 12, 13, 14, that it is relevant and it is alive. And that as they read it and as they get to understand who Jesus is better and grow to know and love him more, that they will grow into women of God, wanting to share that truth with others and keep living for him for the whole of their lives.